How to Receive Money from the Universe, written by Justice O. Malcolm, published by Audiobooks Office. Introduction How to Receive Money from the Universe is a revolutionary guide that unlocks the secrets to attracting financial abundance through the vast, benevolent forces of the universe. This enlightening book shifts the paradigm from earning money through hard labor to receiving it as a flow of universal generosity. With a blend of spiritual wisdom, quantum physics, and practical financial strategies, the author unveils the process of aligning with the energetic frequency of money, making it not just a possibility, but a natural outcome of this harmonious alignment. Each chapter is crafted to take you on a step-by-step -step journey towards understanding and harnessing the laws of attraction and abundance. From overcoming limiting beliefs about money to cultivating a mindset of wealth and learning how to take inspired action, the book offers a comprehensive blueprint for anyone looking to improve their financial situation, not through exhaustive effort, but through openness, trust, and alignment with the abundance that the universe has to offer. How to Receive Money from the Universe is filled with actionable advice, deep insights, and practical ideas designed to transform your relationship with money. The author shares the ideas of those who have successfully navigated the path to abundance, providing you with real-life experiences of how changing one's vibrational stance can lead to significant financial breakthroughs. This book is an invitation to break free from the cycle of scarcity and struggle, offering you a new perspective on wealth that encourages you to embrace the universe's desire to provide. It's for anyone who believes that there's more to life than the constant pursuit of financial security, and who is ready to open their arms to the prosperity that awaits when they align with the generous, ever-giving energy of the universe. How to Receive Money from the Universe promises to be an essential guide for manifesting wealth in a way that feels aligned, effortless, and deeply fulfilling. You're a vital element of the universe, full of wealth. Understand that this abundance is your birthright. Begin by establishing clear financial objectives. Visualize your fortune and be grateful. Connect your well-being and prosperity, they are intertwined. Use the power of the universe's potential to manifest your desires. Maintain an optimistic attitude, be patient and persist. Celebrate your financial triumphs, they demonstrate the power that you have. Explore the wealth manifestation ideas in this book, they will inspire you. This only touches the surface of the universe's vast riches that await you. Discover more as you work towards your financial success. Take a plunge and accept the limitless possibilities. For more information about the ebook version of this audio, visit audiobooksoffice.com. We notice that 75% of you who listen to our video are not yet subscribed to the channel. Please help support the channel by hitting the subscribe button and like the video. Thanks for inspiring us to create more content for you. Chapter 1. Understanding the Universe's Abundance Embrace the truth the universe's abundance is your birthright, and it's waiting for you to access it. You're not separate from this vast, limitless cosmos, but an integral part of it. The universe isn't stingy, it's overflowing with prosperity, and guess what? It's all there for you. Think of the universe as an infinite bank, and you have an unlimited credit card. But unlike a traditional bank, there are no penalties, no interest rates, no repayment plans. The universe doesn't ask for anything in return. The only thing you need to do is believe in this abundance and be open to receive it. Understand that this isn't some abstract, whimsical idea. It's practical, it's real. Just like gravity, just like the air you breathe, the universe's abundance is a principle, a law. It's always been there, quietly working behind the scenes. It doesn't discriminate, it doesn't judge. It simply gives, tirelessly, ceaselessly. But you're not a passive bystander in this process. You're an active participant. Your thoughts, your feelings, your actions, they all matter. They're the keys to accessing this abundance. So dive deep into your consciousness, into your heart. Start cultivating thoughts of prosperity, feelings of gratitude, actions of generosity. Yes, it requires effort. It requires faith. But remember, you're not alone in this. The universe is rooting for you. It's cheering for you. So take that first step, reach out, and claim your birthright. The universe's abundance is yours for the taking. Are you ready to receive it? Chapter 2 the Law of Attraction Basics Now that you're open to the idea of the universe's abundance, let's explore the Law of Attraction, 
a fundamental principle that can help you tap into this limitless prosperity. The law of attraction proposes that like attracts like. This means your thoughts, feelings, and actions create energy that attracts similar energy. If you focus on positive, prosperous thoughts, you'll attract wealth and abundance. Understand that your thoughts are powerful. They're like a magnet pulling towards you what's in harmony with them. If you're constantly thinking about lack, you'll attract lack. But if you think about abundance, you'll draw wealth. It's a law, not a theory. It operates constantly, whether you're aware of it or not. Your feelings are equally important. They're a signal showing you what you're attracting. If you're feeling good, you're on the right track. If you're feeling bad, it's a sign to shift your focus. So cultivate emotions of gratitude, joy, and excitement about wealth. Remember, it's not enough to just think and feel. You must also act. Take steps that align with your desire for prosperity. Trust the process, have patience, and be persistent. The universe doesn't operate on our timeline. But rest assured, your wealth is on its way. In essence, the law of attraction is about harmony. Align your thoughts, experiences, and actions with the wealth you desire. You're a powerful creator, capable of attracting abundance from the universe. Embrace this truth, and let the law of attraction work in your favor. Chapter 3 Setting Your Financial Intentions Setting your financial intentions is the next essential step in receiving abundance from the universe, and it's something you can start doing right now. It's about more than just dreaming of wealth. It's about defining what financial success means to you. Start by asking yourself what you want. Do you want to be debt-free? Do you aspire to own a home? Maybe you dream of a comfortable retirement or having the means to travel the world. Be specific about what you're aiming for. The universe responds best to clear, concise goals. Next, write your intentions down. There's power in putting pen to paper. It makes your desires tangible and real. It's not just a dream anymore, it's a plan. Write them as if they're already accomplished. For example, instead of writing I want to pay off my debt right I am debt free. Remember financial intentions aren't just about money. They're about what that money can bring into your life. Freedom, security, peace of mind, these are the things you're truly seeking. So when setting your intentions, focus also on these feelings. Lastly, believe in your intentions. Trust that the universe will provide and remain open to opportunities that come your way. Stay positive, keep your goals in mind, and make your actions align with your intentions. This isn't just wishful thinking. It's a powerful method to attract abundance from the universe. Your financial journey starts with setting your intentions. So get clear on what you want, write it down, believe in it, and watch as the universe responds. Chapter 4 Visualizing Your Wealth Imagine for a moment the life you'd lead with the wealth you desire. You're not merely daydreaming, you're actively engaging in visualization, a powerful tool that can help bring your financial intentions to fruition. Visualization is a well-established technique that involves creating a mental image of your envisioned outcome, in this case, financial abundance. It's not about hoping for wealth, but rather seeing it in your mind's eye as a present reality. Start by envisioning what wealth means to you. It's not always about stacks of cash or a hefty bank account. Maybe it's the freedom to travel, the ability to provide for your loved ones, or the comfort of a secure retirement. Once you've defined it, Picture it vividly and in detail. See yourself living that life, feeling the emotions associated with it, and relishing the experiences it brings. This isn't just wishful thinking. The process of visualization works by aligning your thoughts and experiences with the energy of the universe. By focusing on your wealth with positive emotions, you're sending a clear, strong signal to the universe about your intentions. Don't just do this once. Make it a regular practice, ideally daily and especially when you're relaxed and undisturbed. As you continue to visualize your wealth, you're strengthening your connection with the universe and paving the way for your financial intentions to manifest. Chapter 5 Gratitude the Key to Abundance Just as you've honed your ability to visualize wealth, cultivating gratitude can also lead to an abundant life. Gratitude, the simple act of being thankful, is a powerful tool that can reveal the universe's bounty. It's not just about being thankful for what you have, it's about recognizing the potential for abundance in every moment. 
Here's a practical tip. Start a gratitude journal. Every day, write down five things you're grateful for. They do not have to be extravagant. They can be as basic as a decent cup of coffee, a stranger's smile, or a beautiful day. This technique teaches you to see and appreciate the pleasant things in your life, attracting more of the same. Now, you might ask, how does gratitude attract wealth? Well, it's about energy and mindset. When you're grateful, you're fundamentally saying, I have enough, and I'm open to receiving more. This attitude resonates with the universe's energy, attracting more abundance into your life. But remember, gratitude isn't merely a means to an end, it's a way of life. Don't just practice gratitude to get rich, practice it because it enriches your life. When you cultivate gratitude, you're not just attracting material wealth, you're also inviting joy, peace and contentment into your life. Chapter 6. Removing Financial Blocks Your journey to financial abundance isn't just about attracting wealth, it's also about removing the roadblocks that are holding you back. These obstacles aren't physical barriers, they're mental and emotional blocks, deeply ingrained beliefs, and attitudes about money that you've likely held since childhood. Unblocking your flow of wealth starts with identifying these limiting beliefs. Maybe you think you don't deserve money, or that it's the root of all evil. These beliefs act like a dam, disrupting the flow of abundance the universe wants to send your way. It's time to break down that dam. Start by writing down your beliefs about money. Be honest with yourself. It's only by acknowledging these blocks that you can begin to dismantle them. Next, challenge each belief. Ask yourself, is this really true more often than not? You'll find it isn't. Now, replace each limiting belief with a positive affirmation. Instead of money is evil, affirm money is a tool for good. Instead of I don't deserve wealth, say I am worthy of abundance. Repeat these affirmations daily until they become your new beliefs. Chapter 7. The Importance of Giving While manifesting wealth is crucial, it's equally important to understand the power of giving back. This isn't just about charity or an essential obligation. It's about creating a cycle of abundance that benefits you as much as it does others. When you give, you open yourself to the flow of abundance from the universe. You're declaring, I have more than enough. You're showing faith in the universe's ability to provide. This positivity and belief are magnetic, attracting more wealth your way. But how do you give? It needn't be grand gestures or large amounts of money. It's the act of giving, the intention behind it, that matters. Give your time, knowledge, or resources. Help a friend, donate to a cause, or simply share a smile. Every act of giving sends out positive energy into the universe. Remember, giving shouldn't feel like a sacrifice. If it does, that sends out a message of lack, not abundance. Give freely, joyfully, and without expectation of return. This creates an energy of abundance and positivity. Also, don't forget to give to yourself. It's crucial to treat yourself with kindness and generosity. Invest in your growth and your happiness. When you value yourself, the universe mirrors that value back to you. Chapter 8. Creating a Prosperity Mindset Cultivating a prosperity mindset, where you view wealth and success as within your grasp, is the next powerful step in attracting abundance from the universe. Begin with a shift in your perspective. Instead of viewing money as scarce and hard to attain, See it as something that continually flows, just waiting for you to tap into its current. To foster this mindset, you need to let go of limiting beliefs. Do you often find yourself thinking, I can't afford this or I'll never be wealthy? It's time to replace these negative thoughts with a firm belief in your ability to attract wealth. Remember, the universe responds to the energy you're giving off. If you're constantly emitting signals of lack, that's exactly what you'll attract. Next. Cultivate gratitude. Being thankful for what you already have creates a positive energy that attracts more of the same. Appreciate the money that flows into your life, no matter how small the amount. This is not about disregarding your financial troubles, rather, it is about focusing on the positive parts of your finances. Chapter 9 Daily Affirmations for Wealth Building on the prosperity mindset, incorporating daily affirmations for wealth into your routine can greatly amplify your power to attract abundance. It's easy to overlook the potency of words, but make no mistake, your words hold power. They shape your thoughts, which in turn shape your reality. By consciously choosing words that vibrate with abundance and prosperity, 
you're aligning yourself with the wealth you desire. Start with simple affirmations. Stand in front of a mirror every morning and declare, I am a magnet for wealth and abundance. Feel the truth in those words that resonate within you. You're not just saying these words, you're embodying them. As you progress, make your affirmations more specific. Instead of merely stating, I attract wealth, say, I invite an abundance of money into my life from multiple sources. This not only affirms your capacity to generate wealth, but also opens up various channels for the universe to deliver. Don't just limit your affirmations to mornings. Use them throughout the day. When you find yourself doubting your capacity to attract wealth, counter those thoughts with your affirmations. I am financially successful money comes to me easily or I am deserving of abundance are powerful phrases to rewire your thoughts towards wealth. Embrace the power of daily affirmations and you'll soon notice changes not just in your mindset but in your actual financial situation. Remember that the universe responds to the energy you send out. So speak wealth, think wealth, and attract wealth. It's your divine right. Chapter 10 The Role of Meditation in Wealth Surprisingly, meditation plays a significant role in attracting wealth, shaping not just your mindset, but aligning your energy with the abundance of the universe. This might seem counterintuitive. After all, you're not doing anything tangible or concrete during meditation. But it's in this stillness that real shifts occur. Think of meditation as your personal tuning fork. It aligns you with the universe's frequency of abundance. When you're in tune, you resonate with opportunities and possibilities you might have missed otherwise. You become open to the wealth the universe has to offer. Meditation also cultivates a sense of inner peace, reducing stress, and freeing your mind from the constant chatter that often impedes clear thinking. With a calm, clear mind, you'll find it easier to spot opportunities, make good decisions, and take actions that lead to wealth. Find a quiet spot. Sit comfortably. Close your eyes, take deep breaths, and simply focus on your breath. If your thoughts wander, gently bring them back to your breath. Begin with a few minutes per day and gradually increase your meditation time as you get more comfortable. Chapter 11. Aligning Actions with Intentions To truly access the universe's wealth, you need to align your actions with your intentions. This is more than just wishful thinking, it's about making conscious decisions that move you closer to your financial goals. You're not merely hoping for wealth, you're actively working towards it. First, define what financial abundance looks like for you. Is it owning a home, being debt-free, or having an overflowing bank account? Once you've painted this picture, it's time to set your intentions. These are the guiding lights on your path to abundance. They're the why behind your what. But intentions aren't enough. They must be followed by actions. Here's where many fall short. They set intentions, but their actions don't mirror them. If your intention is to attract wealth, but you're spending recklessly, there's a misalignment. Your actions must reflect your intentions. This isn't a time for half measures. Be bold, be deliberate. If your goal is financial independence, study about investments, make a budget, and stick to it. If you aim for a comfortable retirement, start saving today, not tomorrow. Chapter 12 Trusting the Universe's Timing Once your actions are in harmony with your intentions, it's important to trust that the universe operates on its own timeline. It's not always vital, but it's essential. You've set your intentions, you've aligned your actions, now it's time to allow the universe to do its part. Remember, the universe isn't on your clock. It doesn't work by the Gregorian calendar or by your personal deadlines. It operates on its own time, which is perfect and precise. It's like the tide, it comes in its own time, yet it never fails to arrive. You may see no movement for days, weeks, or even months, but that doesn't mean the universe isn't working on your behalf. It's critical to stay patient and positive during this waiting period. It's easy to doubt, to lose faith, to wonder if you're doing it right. But that's when you need to hold on to your belief with both hands. Trust that everything in existence is working in your favor, even if you do not see it. Use this time for self-improvement, for honing your skills, and for nurturing your relationships. Be active, not anxious. Be hopeful, not doubtful. Understand the beauty of divine timing and appreciate the waiting period as a time for growth and preparation. Chapter 13. Using Crystals for Wealth 
Harnessing the power of crystals can be a potent step in attracting wealth and prosperity from the universe. These natural stones, each with their own unique vibrational energy, can act as catalysts, drawing in the energy you desire. And in this case, you're aiming for wealth. Start by choosing the right crystals. Some of the most potent stones for attracting wealth are citrine, pyrite, and green aventurine. Citrine, known as the merchant stone, attracts abundance and success. Pyrite, also called fool's gold, symbolizes wealth and good luck. Green aventurine, also known as the stone of opportunity, is thought to be the luckiest of all crystals, particularly when it comes to generating riches and money. Next, cleanse and charge your crystals. You can't expect to draw wealth from a depleted source. Rinse them under running water, then leave them in sunlight or moonlight to recharge. You're not just cleaning them physically, you're resetting their energy, preparing them to work for you. Now, set your intention. Hold each crystal in your hand, close your eyes, and visualize the wealth you're inviting into your life. Feel the energy of the universe connecting with the crystal and with you. Remember, it's a partnership you're working with the crystal and with the universe. Finally, keep your crystals close. Keep them in your pocket, use them as jewelry, or display them at your workspace. Their constant presence will act as a reminder of your intention and a beacon for the wealth you're seeking to attract. You've got the power to harness the universe's wealth. Start using it. Chapter 14. The Power of Positive Thinking Always remember that your mind is a powerful instrument by keeping a good attitude, you may attract an abundance of money and prosperity into your life. Think of your subconscious as a magnet, attracting energy, opportunity, and individuals who share your positive thoughts. When you focus on the positive, you're telling the universe, I'm ready for the good stuff. Send it my way, it might sound a bit mystical, but the results can be tangible and real. The key is to be conscious of your thoughts. Are you thinking about lack, or are you focusing on abundance? It's easy to fall into the trap of negative thinking, but it won't serve you well. Instead, challenge those thoughts. Redirect them towards positivity and abundance. You'll be surprised at the shift in your energy and how the universe responds. This isn't about wishful thinking or blind optimism. It's about fostering a genuine belief in your worth, your potential, and the good things the universe has in store for you. Positive affirmation can be an effective tool in this process. Start each day by affirming something positive about your financial situation. It could be something as simple as I am open to receive wealth from the universe. And remember, positive thinking isn't just about money. It's about overall prosperity, happiness, and success. So don't limit your positive thoughts to your finances. Open your mind to the possibility of positivity and abundance in all areas of your life. The universe is listening, and it's ready to respond. Chapter 15. Cultivating Patience and Persistence While maintaining a positive mindset is key, it's equally important to foster patience and persistence in your journey to receive wealth from the universe. Understand that the universe works on its own timeline, not yours. Just because you don't see results immediately doesn't mean your efforts are in vain. Patience, dear friend, is a virtue you must cultivate. It's the ability to tolerate delay without getting frustrated or giving up. It's the quiet confidence that everything will happen in its own time. Remember, the universe is abundant and will provide for you, but it may not always operate on your schedule. Similarly, persistence is all about continuing your efforts despite difficulties or delay in achieving success. If you've set an intention to attract wealth and abundance, you must keep that intention alive, even when it seems like nothing is happening. The universe responds to consistent energy and effort. To cultivate patience, practice mindfulness and meditation. These approaches can assist you in remaining calm and focused throughout periods of waiting. You might experience moments of doubt or feel like giving up, but don't. Patience is about trusting the process, even when you can't see the outcome. For persistence, set clear goals and remind yourself of them regularly. Keep your eyes on the prize and don't let temporary setbacks deter you. Always keep in mind that the route to prosperity is a marathon, not a sprint. In essence, patience and persistence are your companions on this journey. Embrace them, and they'll lead you to the wealth and abundance you desire from the universe. Chapter 16. Developing a Wealth Journal 
In your journey towards embracing abundance, starting your own wealth journal can be a game-changing step. It's not just about recording your financial transactions, it's about tapping into the rhythm of the universe and directing it towards your prosperity. Crafting a wealth journal starts with choosing a notebook that resonates with you. It could be a simple spiral journal, a lavish leather-bound diary, or a digital app. Once you've selected your journal, it's time to define your financial goals. To be specific and realistic, yet don't shy away from dreaming big. The universe loves a bold heart. Next, you'll jot down your goals, along with the steps you plan to take to achieve them. This process helps to crystallize your aspirations and gives them a tangible form. Remember, the universe can't help you manifest your desires if it's uncertain about what you want. Every day, spend a few minutes updating your wealth journal. Capture your income, expenses, and savings. But don't stop at mere numbers. Record your thoughts, emotions, and insights about money. Express gratitude for the wealth you already have and the wealth that's on its way to you. This practice helps you stay aligned with the abundance of the universe. Developing a wealth journal isn't just a task, it's a ritual. It's an act of faith in the universe's generosity and your potential to receive it. So pick up the notebook and start writing. The universe is listening, and it's keen to fill your pages with prosperity. Chapter 17. Navigating Financial Challenges Even amidst financial challenges, you've got the power to steer through and usher in prosperity into your life. It's crucial to realize that money is energy, and your thoughts and feelings about it can influence your financial reality. You can attract wealth from the universe by aligning your mindset with abundance, not scarcity. First, acknowledge your current situation but don't dwell on the negatives. Instead, focus on the opportunities that lie within these challenges. They're lessons in disguise, teaching you about financial management, resilience, and the value of resourcefulness. Remember, the universe doesn't give you what you want, it gives you what you need to grow. Next, cultivate a positive mindset. Visualize yourself overcoming these financial hurdles with grace and ease. This exercise not only enhances your morale, but it also sends a strong message to the universe that you are open to receiving. Lastly, take practical steps towards financial stability. Trim unnecessary expenses, establish an emergency fund, and consider additional income sources. These actions demonstrate your commitment to financial well-being, which the universe will match in kind. In all, Steering through financial challenges is a journey of growth, inner strength, and tenacity. It's about understanding that money is a tool for experiencing life, not the purpose of it. As you maneuver these challenges, you're not just gaining financial literacy, you're evolving into a more resilient, resourceful, and well-rounded person. Keep going, and remember the universe is always ready to support those who are willing to support themselves. Chapter 18 Celebrating Financial Milestones Upon reaching each financial milestone, it's essential to celebrate these victories, acknowledging them as concrete evidence of your progress and the universe's reaction to your positive energy. It's not just about the money, it's also about you evolving into a person who's capable of attracting and managing wealth. Think about it this way, each milestone you reach is a proof of your abilities and a sign that you've successfully tapped into the universe's abundance. You've put in the work, you've stayed consistent, and now you're reaping the rewards. That's worth celebrating. But how should you celebrate? Well, it's important to do something that resonates with you. It might be as simple as taking a moment to express gratitude for what you've achieved, or perhaps you'd prefer to reward yourself with a treat or experience you've been looking forward to. Remember, it's not about the size of the celebration, but rather the recognition of your achievement and the positive reinforcement it provides. Celebrating your financial milestones will fuel your motivation to achieve even more. It's a clear signal to the universe that you appreciate the abundance it's offering, and you're ready for more. Each celebration is a step forward on your journey to financial freedom, and a reminder of what you're capable of achieving when you harness the power of the universe. Chapter 19. The Impact of Community on Wealth While you're harnessing the power of the universe, don't underestimate the impact your community can have on your journey to wealth. Surrounding yourself with positive, supportive people is vital. They'll inspire you, challenge you, and help you stay accountable to your financial goals. They're not just spectators, they're part of your team, cheering you on and celebrating your victories with you. Look at the people in your life. 
Are they encouraging your dreams or are they pulling you down? Positive mindsets are contagious, just like negativity. So, choose your company wisely. It's not always about cutting people off, but more about spending more time with those who lift you higher. Networking is another powerful aspect of community. It's about sharing ideas, creating opportunities, and opening doors that you didn't even know existed. Every person you meet is a potential key to a new opportunity. Do not hesitate to seek out, ask questions, and learn from others. Community also brings a sense of belonging. It's that safe space where you can be vulnerable, share your struggles and triumphs, and grow without judgment. It's a source of energy that fuels your journey and a beacon of light when the road seems dark. Chapter 20. Reassessing Your Wealth Goals As you journey along the path to financial abundance, it's crucial to continually reassess your wealth goals, ensuring they align with your evolving dreams and values. The universe is abundant and constantly changing, and so are you. Just like the seasons shift, your goals and desires might also transform. It's not just about the money in your bank account, it's about what that wealth represents and how it can help you achieve your truest desires. Take time at least once a year to revisit your wealth goals. Reflect on the past months. What have been your victories and challenges? Have your dreams changed? If they have, that's perfectly okay. It's a sign of growth, and growth is a critical part of attracting wealth from the universe. Perhaps you started wanting a big house, but now you realize that what you truly want is the freedom to travel. Your wealth goals must reflect this change. It's not a step back, but a step towards a more authentic you. The universe responds to authenticity and clarity of purpose. Remember, wealth isn't just monetary. It's the value you place on your time, your relationships, your peace of mind. These two are goals worth pursuing. As you reassess, be open to the idea that wealth can take many forms. Achieving your wealth goals is a journey, not a race. It's okay to change your mind, redefine your goals, and chart a new course. The universe is always listening, always ready to guide you towards your truest desires. Stay flexible, stay grateful, and keep dreaming big. Chapter 21. The Connection Between Health and Wealth In the pursuit of prosperity, don't forget that your well-being is an essential part of this equation, serving as a cornerstone to truly living a life of abundance. It's not just about the money you have in the bank, but the energy, vitality, and well-being you possess to enjoy that wealth. You're not just accumulating wealth for its own sake, but for the freedom, enjoyment, and opportunities it brings. And what good is all that if you're not healthy enough to enjoy it? Remember, health is wealth. Without good health, even the wealthiest person in the world can feel impoverished. It's important to take care of your physical, mental, and emotional health. That means eating well, getting regular exercise, ensuring you get enough sleep, and taking time to relax and recharge. It's also about maintaining a positive mindset, managing stress, and fostering good relationships. Moreover, a healthy lifestyle can actually support your wealth creation efforts. When you're in good health, you have more energy to dedicate to your goals. You're able to think more clearly, make better decisions, and be more productive. In a way, your health is an investment in your wealth. Chapter 22. Incorporating Feng Shui for Prosperity Just like maintaining your health can enhance your wealth, aligning your living and working spaces according to Feng Shui principles can also pave the way for prosperity. This ancient Chinese art isn't just about rearranging your furniture, it's about creating harmony between you and your environment, opening up the channels for the universe to pour its abundance into your life. Start by decluttering. It's more than mere tidying up, it's about letting go of what no longer serves you, making room for new blessings. Feng Shui emphasizes cleanliness and organization because clutter blocks the flow of positive energy, or qi. So clear out that junk drawer, organize your files, and watch as opportunities start knocking. Next, focus on the wealth corner. In Feng Shui, the far left corner from your front door, or the door of a room, is considered the wealth corner. Enhance this area with symbols of prosperity, a healthy plant, a fountain, or even a piggy bank. The trick is to select products that reflect your personal perception of riches and plenty. Lastly, keep your entrance inviting. The front door is known as the mouth of Qi and Feng Shui, where all your luck and blessings enter. Keep it clean, well-lit, and obstruction-free.
Chapter 23 Learning from Wealth Manifestation Stories Ever wondered how others have tapped into the universe's abundance and manifested wealth in their lives? There's a sea of stories out there, real-life experiences that can inspire and guide you. Now it's your turn to learn from these wealth manifestation stories and use them as stepping stones on your road to financial abundance. Consider the story of Jim Carrey, a famous actor who once was a struggling artist. He wrote himself a $10 million check for acting services provided dated it for Thanksgiving 1995 and put it in his wallet. In 1994, he landed a film part that paid him just that. Carrey visualized his success, believed in it, and the universe responded. Then there's Sarah Centrella, a single mom who used vision boards and affirmations to manifest her dreams. She went from living paycheck to paycheck to becoming a best-selling author and coach. These stories aren't just inspirational, they're practical too. They show you how to harness the universe's power through faith, visualization, and positive affirmation. Remember, it's not just about wanting money, it's about believing you deserve it and visualizing it flowing into your life. Chapter 24 Maintaining Your Wealth Consciousness You've got the power to sustain your wealth consciousness, a key to accessing the universe's abundance. This isn't about fleeting moments of positive thinking. It's about solidifying a consistent mindset of prosperity. It's not always easy, but it's certainly within your reach. Start by maintaining a gratitude journal. Every day, jot down what you're thankful for, especially where finances are concerned. It could be as simple as finding a penny on the sidewalk or as monumental as a promotion. This practice helps reinforce your belief in the universe's generosity, making you more receptive to its wealth. Next, visualize your wealth. Make it a daily ritual to imagine what financial success looks like for you. Feel the emotions that come with it joy, relief, contentment, and let them imbue your consciousness. Visualization is a powerful tool that primes your mind to accept and attract wealth. Don't forget to affirm your wealth. Speak your prosperity into existence. Use positive, present tense statements like I am prosperous or I am attracting wealth from the universe words have power use them to maintain your wealth consciousness. Lastly, surround yourself with wealth positive influences. Read books, listen to podcasts, or associate with people who exude a wealth mindset. Their energy can inspire and bolster your own wealth consciousness. Harnessing the universe's wealth is like tuning into a radio frequency you just need to adjust your mindset. Remember, the universe is abundant, and it's ready to shower you with wealth. Keep visualizing, expressing gratitude, and maintaining a healthy lifestyle. Use Feng Shui to enhance prosperity, and let the stories of successful manifestors inspire you. You're on a journey of wealth consciousness, so keep this book close and the universe closer. Thanks for listening to or reading this from Audiobooks Office.